Hi, this is a short guide on how to install or solder the RSSI output to a common 12 channel receiver. Um, thanks for watching and enjoy. So the first thing to I'm gonna do is <laughs> unbox the uh, receiver. And then you need to unscrew these four screws. Once you have unscrewed everything, um, yeah, you do open up your transmitter box, um, power it. Um, right now I've got channel 4 and um, do connect your video as well um, and then you need a multimeter to figure out which pin is the RSSI pin and the second one uh, you do need the ground so the ground is easy um, you just tip on the on the outer plate of the uh, transmitter box and then you, you you search the pins. Um, I don't already know which one is. It is, and um, so you try it. You see, it's yeah, one point one point two four point yeah, one point two five volts. So if I change the the channel, um, I should get another voltage. And I'm gonna test this. You see it's like uh, 4 volts, which is uh, no connection at all. And now you know um, this is your RSSI pin, you gotta solder. So you do unhook everything and start soldering. And I'm gonna go with the RSSI wire first. This, this is uh, really narrow. And that's it. I'm just gonna select the uh, this place right here because there's solder already on. So what I did is solder the ground to the uh, outside of the box, and the RSSI wire. You, you I could find it between the black and the green wire, and um, yeah, this is it. The the thing you left is uh, to you might want to cover cover the white wire which is unused uh, with a shrink tube or just leave it like it is and then uh, yeah you do have to put it all back together and that's it thanks for watching and feel free to subscribe.